Hi, I'm Rachel Canelli, reporting from River Country in Point Pleasant. And this is your wake-up call that fall is coming, so you'd better get out there and enjoy this beautiful weather while you still can. With Labor Day just around the corner, it's a reminder that school's starting and the clock is ticking on the final days of summer. And since temps are expected to stay in the high 70s to low 80s with almost no humidity, there's no better time to have one last taste of summer. So what are you going to do to end the summer on a good note? And how are you going to get back into your routine? We talked to some folks at River Country who went tubing. Just trying to do as much as you can before the hectic mix comes back. Well, like about a week before school, you start to like go to bed a little bit earlier and like you start to just like wake up earlier just to get the hang of, you know, getting back. Uh, it's kind of a bummer just because uh, I thought I'd get more done, had more fun this summer, but you know, just have to look forward to next summer, I guess. You know, it's rolling up. Had a good time though. Sad. We're sad. It's, it was the end of a great summer. We had a great summer, didn't we, Justin? Yep. Yeah, but it's sad. Pretty much trying not to have a routine as much as possible and know as day one comes along, you need the routine back. I kind of uh, start waking myself up real early in the morning because class starts at 7. I got to get, you know, my classroom stuff together, like my books, my book bag. And then, we, you know, we're getting ready with, uh, you know, reading a little bit in math, a little bit, get back into the swing, but still trying to enjoy the last of, the last of summer. Residents had a good tip about going to bed early, at least a few nights before the big day. Remember to send your questions to rcanelli at phillybirds.com. Reporting for the Bucks County Courier Times and Intelligencer Newspapers, I'm Rachel Canelli.